it's a little difficult because you have to put yourself in the military. Okay. If you were to be in the military, in oh. what branch mm. would you serve? <sighs> Mary Ann McClary, you go Well, first. I'm conflicted about this because I love to wear white. And so you think I would say like a Coast Guard, but they wear sure. like their dress white. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. But I get so seasick. It oh, would never work. Would Coast Guard and the Navy. I and, I, and I also love navy blue. It's one of my favorite mm. colors. So Coast Guard and Navy are out. I guess I would go with the Air Force. Okay. They're pretty tough, those flight suits <laughs> and the aviators, which I look horrible in. But I'd, I'd make it work. I'll go with Air Force. <laughs> You'd make it work. I could, I like a good jumpsuit. Yeah, I'll go with Air Force. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lisa, what about you? Uh, well, I, it wasn't as difficult for me to get to my answer, but my answer is also the Air Force. <laughs> <laughs> I have to rule things out. No, not that one. No. You just want to fly planes? I just want to fly planes. I'm yeah. fascinated. I, I think I'm a little bit of a scaredy cat, but I am fascinated by flying in airplanes. Yeah. There you go. Mm -hmm. There you go. <laughs> Laura, what about you, doll? Air Force would make sense for me as a meteorologist. Right. Of course, a lot of them have to be skilled in the weather. But I'm going to say the Navy just because I want to see all those ports of call, but oh. I do get violently seasick. So <laughs> that would be a tough tour of duty. That would be a tough mm -hmm. one. Yeah. Patch it up. get used to it. Put a patch on it. Keep it moving. Patch on Keep it. it moving. Keep it moving. All right. Let's check in with the uh, the boys in the booth. I believe we've got who? Flavio y Javier. Javier. Yeah, difficult question, Courtney. I'm going to say mm -hmm. the Navy. Okay. I don't know why. Maybe because uh, Jason Maloney served oh, in I the see, Navy. Good friend of us. Uh, I'm trying to think if it's either the Navy or the Air Force, only because I have a good friend of mine from the Optimus Club, retired General Mike Peters. Oh. He was in the Air Force. Wow. So if I don't say Air Force, he's probably going to get mad at me and thump me. Make you drop uh -huh. give him 20. Right? Probably, yeah. yes, yes. Right? <laughs> you don't want that. <laughs> Actually, I would love to see that. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll invite you on a Thursday when we meet over here at uh, Lucas and you come over and see him thump me. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. I, just because I, I would try to follow in my father's footsteps, although I cannot follow in that man's footsteps. He's kind of amazing. Uh, but my dad served in the Army. For years, so I would try the army, but woo child, <laughs> <laughs> the thought of basic training just oh, I, like seriously. There are certain people who are absolutely meant to serve our country. Right. I am not one of those people because I am a punk. <laughs> <laughs> this kid right here. <laughs> but I would try. I would try the uh, the army. You know, but I tell you, I think it just it does build character and it builds stamina.